think that um, programmers across the board probably face the same challenges, and I can't answer that firsthand because um, I haven't programmed for a company like Clear Channel or Pacer, you know, big for-profit presenters. I, I haven't done that, so I can't speak to what the challenges are in their jobs. Um, but one of the things that um, comes to mind immediately is that um, as a nonprofit company, corporate, a nonprofit organization, we count on a, our income to come in in advance. And as such, you'll see orchestras and operas and theaters and organizations like us, you'll see that we launch a series. And we launch the series in the um, you know, at one particular time of year, it's annual. And part of launching that series is so that people will um, subscribe. And when somebody subscribes, that's dependable income that you know you have. We don't operate on a concert to concert basis. A for profit company can do that, where they can book a show two months out and then book another one a week later. And it's a little bit more of a rotating cycle where people are buying their tickets throughout the entire year at a um, for a major for-profit company whereas here the people are buying the majority of their tickets at one time during the year and the challenge that brings in when we're dealing with popular artists is that popular artists aren't always willing to set their schedule a year and a half out so it can be kind of hard to pin down an artist for 2008 right now in the summer of 2006, we need to do that because we need to be able to have a series to launch a subscription. But um, that's not always, doesn't always make sense with contemporary artists because they don't know if they're going to be out recording a record or if they're going to be on tour overseas or what they're going to be doing. So that's an immediate challenge that comes to mind. But um, in terms of booking artists, I mean, I think we kind of all have the same I use the same agencies that um, the Clear Channel uses, so you're kind of dealing with a lot of the same people. Um, it's just that we sort of have to build in a little bit more lead time than they than they do.